It's a sketch comedy podcast show. For years, I suffered from chronic gamophobia, a condition more commonly known as a fear of commitment. Year after year, I would meet a wonderful woman who would have the nerve to ask me for security in our relationships. Nothing would send me running faster. I didn't have time for that. I was a young man. I needed to see what was out there. Then, I wasn't a young man anymore. But, due to my condition, I was unable to reciprocate the love and appreciation I was shown by the women I was in relationships with. I finally decided to do something about it. I talked to my doctor about commit to all, and he prescribed it to me. I was told that this condition was extremely common for men my age, but it had become widely accepted among our generation. Talk to your doctor today about commit to all. Users of commit to all reported the following most common side effects sharing their life with a partner of their choosing, feeling the unconditional love and acceptance from a partner that accepts them and their flaws, increased joy in doing what they can do to make their partner happy, possibly choosing to breed and raise a family with said partner, improved sleep as they feel confident they have found someone to grow old with, feeling like a grown-ass man in a grown-ass relationship, and diarrhea. So stop being a pussy and call your doctor today about commit to all. It bettered my life and I know it can do the same for you. Consult your physician before starting Commit to All. Commit to All is not approved for all uses and should not be used by women, as women are more likely to have a naturally higher degree of grown the F up hormone and could overdose. So talk to your doctor today about Commit to All and grow the f up.